How's it going, Webheads? My name is Ryan Walsh, and of course, this is the brand new sneak peek for Black Panther. This is called Rise TV Spot. This was just like kind of announced and kind of shown during the uh, national championship for uh, college football. I don't really follow that at all, but honestly, I wanted to do a trailer reaction because I promised this uh, to you guys. Um, probably like a week ago when I had that new trailer video. Um, I might be doing a breakdown at the end of this video. I might be saving that for another video. I'm going to find out when uh, we see this entire thing. Because I don't know if there's going to be a ton of new footage. Because I thought there's going to be like a trailer 3. Not a TV spot. But guys, make sure you guys definitely just subscribe for more Black Panther. Turn on that notification bell, of course. Smash that like button and comment below your thoughts. But guys, let's get into this thing. And hopefully we see some new uh, awesome footage for Black Panther. Of course, I'm going to be over here so I can put uh, the trailer actually right here so we can make it a little bit better. Um, but let's see. All right. Let's go with it. Ooh, claw. Love You're telling it. me that the king of a third world country runs around in a bulletproof awesome. cat suit? Oh my god, that was awesome! He <laughs> the door right off. My king. Awesome. The Black Panther lives. There we go. Oh, cool! They have a pop of that. That's really cool. I like that new mask. He's coming. That's damn calm. Watch me do my. I hope you're ready, bro. I'm just getting started. Damn. Let's have some fun. Oh, I love it. I love the new song. You show off. You don't want to see me get in They just want to see me swimming in the dirt. Don't drown on ground with a tear. Yeah, I want one free swim from the air. I want your weapons. How you want to play your secrets? Hops on the radar. It's all mine now. Yo. Is this your king? This looks pretty good. <laughs> I love that shot. That is so cool. Get tickets now. I'm definitely gonna pre-order my tickets after this because honestly, that was pretty sweet. I like that TV spot. That was pretty good. Um, I didn't think there was a ton of new footage. I will say that, but of course. We got like less than, no, we have like, I think it's, what, we have, yeah, we have more than a month to go, but still, um, I did think there was going to be a little bit more footage than that, but honestly, that was a pretty good trailer, that, or TV spot, I thought that was a pretty good TV spot, um, I do like how we definitely saw a little bit more of that shot that we're talking about with the end credit scene for Black Panther, basically my speculation on it was that we're going to see the Soul Stone, and of course, that, that maybe that, um, that one shot of where, you know, it's like, it has like the purple sky. I don't really know where that's going to be. I don't think anybody really does. But it looks, it looks to me that that's definitely going to be a sacred place. And of course, we saw one more shot of that, which it looks awesome. And he's definitely saw some panthers, some actual like black panthers in like that African tree. It looked amazing. And um, it, it looks awesome. And we definitely saw another clip of like claw shooting out. Like it looked like it, he literally blew out an entire building. That's what it looked like. Uh, that was awesome. I absolutely loved it. I, I am going to do a breakdown for this trailer and there's something else that came out like a week ago or something like that. So I'm going to be breaking that down as well. So guys, I'm going to be going right into my breakdown. So now really breaking down this brand new Rise TV spot. There was a lot that we definitely saw within this TV spot that was new. Now I'm really going to be going by uh, the shots that I personally thought that were actually new. And this was the first one. And this isn't really a new scene or anything like that. This is just kind of new dialogue. And this is really just showing that Ulysses Claw and Everett Ross are kind of basically just talking in this room and of course Black Panther is in the next room and this just really to me really just shows that Ulysses Claw he basically called out to Everett Ross that Black Panther was in the next room T'Challa was in the next room so personally to me this kind of just screamed that he's not just one of those basic criminals that don't really know anything he actually is a very intelligent 
person. So that's what this really just screamed to me and I just wanted to kind of mention that. Now this next shot actually is probably my favorite shot of the entire TV spot. I absolutely love this. I love it when T'Challa is getting this head mask put on him and you basically see that this, he is in the Warriors Falls. And basically what the Warrior Falls is, it's basically going to be a scene within the movie where T'Challa is actually getting coronated as the new king of Wakanda. And he's actually officially becoming the new Black Panther and officially becoming the king of Wakanda. This is a tradition for every single king of Wakanda to go through. And of course T'Challa is the next king up because King T'Chaka died in Civil War. So now he's going through his coronation at Warriors Falls. I think this shot's really cool with the mask of T'Challa because we actually have a pop that actually came out for T'Challa and this is basically called the Black Panther Warrior Falls pop and I personally think this is probably one of the coolest pops to come out of the Black Panther Funko line. Of course I'm a collector of pops so I had to mention this because I think this pop is super cool and I just love the design on this figure. Next up is actually our first shot that I personally have seen of any of the trailers. This is the first scene I think we've seen of him and this is the character Zuri in Black Panther. I just wanted to kind of shout him out because he is a character that we have not seen in any of the other trailers that have come out. Next up is a shot of Shiri and this this is kind of just her inside of this futuristic car. Of course, she's the one who basically handles all the high tech stuff within Wakanda. And of course, she's going to be providing all of the gadgets for Black Panther and kind of giving him his new suit and designing the new suit that he gets within the movie. And of course, I feel as though she definitely keeps all of the good stuff for herself because of course, this car definitely is one of the good stuff because it looks super high tech. And of course, we've seen it dozens of times before in the trailers and TV spots that we've seen before for Black Panther. She gets these panther cannons on her hands and they look absolutely awesome. And this is the shot that I was really talking about and the reaction that I definitely caught within this trailer. And I personally think that this is definitely going to be a way for T'Challa to actually talk with the older Black Panthers and the older kings of Wakanda to kind of seek wisdom and to kind of get some help from them and speak to their souls. Because personally, I think this is what the Soul Stone is actually going to be. I think this is going to be the heart of Wakanda. And of course, I think each one of those Black Panthers are actually going to be the other kings that have actually been king before T'Challa. Those are going to be his ancestors. And I personally think there's the imagery in this shot looks amazing and I think the Panthers themselves look awesome. The next shot that we see is actually a really cool shot that I pointed out in my reaction where you get to see Ulysses Claw. They're in that casino and of course Ulysses Claw is using his vibranium cannon on Black Panther it looks like and it just looks awesome. I thought I thought he was taking out an entire building with that but actually it's just kind of an entire room but still it looks absolutely awesome and I can't wait to see this action scene within the movie. And that was really it that I really caught from the entire Rise TV spot. And now really onto this other trailer that came out kind of like a week ago. I think it came out about a week ago or something like that. And actually, this is basically an origin trailer. This is called the origin trailer for Black Panther. And it's really just Kevin Feige, um, Ryan Coogler, the director, and Stan Lee really talking about who Black Panther is and Chadwick Boseman as well, who plays Black Panther. Um, really just talking about the origin of Black Panther and how he was created in the comic books and stuff like that. And of course, you get to see this awesome shot here. This is something that I kind of picked out. This is a behind the scene shot of Black Panther in his new suit in an action scene with a bunch of Wakandans. Of course, it looks absolutely awesome. I cannot wait to see the action in this movie. I think it's definitely going to be some of the best action that we've seen in an MCU movie to this day. And honestly, I think this shot does look awesome. And the last thing that I really wanted to point out about this trailer, because it's the only thing that we really got that was new for Black Panther trailer, and it's actually this artwork that's shown of all the Avengers kind of fighting. Of course, I couldn't really get any of the other Avengers in this because it went too quickly, so it was all blurry. But this really is just Black Panther and Hulk. And of course, if you guys really look at this Black Panther and Hulk, you can definitely tell that they have pointy ears and they definitely have giant chins and this really shows that they are actually scrolls instead of the actual avengers so this really kind of gets me guessing are they going to be introducing scrolls this early in the mcu with black panther and are any of the avengers actually going to be revealed as a scroll in the future movies like avengers of fame war avengers 4 people are definitely speculating that and personally i think this actually definitely confirms that we are going to be seeing scrolls take the appearance of some avengers in future movies because why else would marvel 
put this shot in there. Of course, it definitely raises some questions, but that's really all I have for this video today. Definitely a lot shown from the origin trailer and the TV spot for Black Panther. Guys, we're a little over a month away until Black Panther. This is probably the last thing I'll do on footage of the Black Panther movie, but guys, let me know down in the comments what did you guys think of this new Black Panther footage? Did you guys like it, not like it? Of course, make sure you guys definitely smash the like button if you guys like this video. Of course, subscribe to Webhead for more on Black Panther. Of course, I have my movie review and my spoilers review coming out when I see the movie. Of course, make sure you guys definitely turn on that notification bell so you guys don't miss anything on my channel. And definitely join my Black Panther giveaway. All you guys gotta be is a subscriber on my channel and make sure you guys definitely leave a comment in the comment section. But guys, thank you very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Bye-bye. Alrighty, Webheads, if you guys like this video and you guys want to see more, make sure you guys definitely subscribe right over here to Webhead to see more on the Black Panther. I have plenty of videos coming out for that. Of course, make sure you guys definitely turn on that notification bell. Of course, make sure you guys definitely check out my social media links in the description below so you guys can follow me on various social media networks. And of course, check out the two videos below me. I think you guys would really, really enjoy. But thank you guys very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Bye-bye.